Hello and welcome to Surf All Day A1A, your place for real Florida surfing and updates, surf updates. So right now, Tropical Storm Ada is pulling off the Florida coast, and Central Florida is beginning basic has stacked all of the sand up very shallow throughout this here. Made a nice deep trough, and by the way, this is low tide, a very deep trough all the way through here where it's not breaking or connecting at all. And then nice little outside sandbars. As you can see on the outside, the power is not that great. But on the inside, there are little nuggets of wonderfulness occurring. Look at that outside set. Oh, oh look at that outside set. See, that thing, although it looks pretty, it doesn't have a lot of juice in it. But look on the inside. Ba -pa! That's where the good stuff is, so depending. So I was looking at these conditions, it's not much of a long ride. It's still got power, plenty of size, but this offshore wind... Sandbar set up a hundred times. A thousand times. It's nice to see the transition as the beach changes, but this will not last either. Look on the outside. Bomber set. Try to get out of the wind here. It's still blowing about 20, 25 miles an hour, but I tried to get in a more protected spot. Yeah, I don't know if, it, Andrew, yeah. Is it gonna be good this afternoon? I think the size is going to continue to drop. If I would say one rule for surfing in Florida that is when it looks like this get on it go now it's an hour after low tide where I'm at so it's perfect tide but you can see the sandbars clearly are doing that so I made kind of an odd choice for a surfboard today let me know if it gets too windy A lot of seaweed on the beach. There it is, the clever nine foot longboard. Yep, I'm surfing a longboard today. I feel like it's the right thing to do. As far as I look down the beach in either direction, I don't see one other person. It's amazing. The waves look good. I'm sure I'm going to get at least a dozen waves that'll be super fun out there. Look at that. Every one of them just A-framing. So, you know, even though we didn't get the... And then it fizzles out through the... Interesting. It's kind of trophy right on the inside of the outside, too. Whoa, look at that. Peaking left and right. Peeling. Yeah. Little tip. And you got north winds in Florida on the east coast. Go left. <laughs> yeah, so this this clever surfboard is a great one because it's epoxy, so it's super super light, nine feet long, so it really just goes. Your back's been hurting? Yeah. Flip side fishing. Don't I know? Man, I can totally sympathize with the hurting back. Actually, at this specific spot, I injured my back severely years ago, probably 15 years ago. Severe injury, uh, herniated seven discs in my back severely, and uh, one actually exploded into into the uh, spinal column area. And they had to, anyway. Long story short, don't I know it? Yeah, I've got to almost get behind myself and push some days, especially when I can come up with excuses as to why not go, to go out. <laughs> Easy. I can generate a list a mile long. But this is a good one. Look at that on the inside. Oh, down the beach. See that longboard, you can just paddle right at it and get to the the good stuff. Yeah, well, pretty good. Okay, I'm gonna kill the live stream. Thanks for everybody that jumped on. Appreciate it. Made it more fun. 
Hope you get out there today. Have fun. Keep it real. Keep it safe. Later, dude.